Very good morning my friends, how are you? Hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new deal of the day video from Extreme Trader. This is Salah speaking. So we are back to the deal of the day videos and I hope you guys are aware right now that these trades or these deals should be entered under your own and full responsibility. I don't take personally any responsibility for these deals at all. This is only my advices and these are my suggestions for everyone who, who wish to enter uh, to trade with the gold. Please always remember that you have to keep you, you, uh, maintaining your balance and maintaining your funds. Make sure that you are aware that you might lose the trade, that you, the trade might fail. And of course, uh, have a proper money management and uh, check always how much you might lose and how much you might, might make profit from these deals. Of course, we will go right now to the gold. And if we check the gold on the four hour time frame, we can notice right here the strong bullish engulfing candle. And that actually that candle has confirmed that the gold is going to continue the rise. I don't see the gold is actually going to um, reverse from that resistance. It's just making right now a small pullback. And if I'm not mistaken, we can rely on that strong key support level on 1833 to decide that we can start again buying the gold. So that being said, on the four hour time frame, it has been confirmed that the gold is good for the buy. Let's right now go to the four, uh, 15 minute time frame. Now on the 15 minute time frame, actually I have already done this analysis. I, I, I have drawn here the support trend line like that. And I have dragged it like this all the way here to this previous uh, resistance trend line. This is actually one of the strategies that I have explained before on uh, previous videos. However, as you can see, the gold right now is reversing from the resistance as i said and it seems like it's just make a small pullback just to hit that previous uh, resistance trend line and it's going to become a new res uh, support trend line and after that it's going to continue the rise for a few pips so let me just check for you how many pips we can expect to make from this trade if i'm not mistaken the gold is going to actually continue the rise until it hit the long-term resistance right here on 1848 so therefore, we can start buying at 1,833 and we can expect uh, about 152 pips profit from this deal. That being said, gold is going to be good for the buy at the level 1,833.38. Let's check. And of course, the take profit level is going to be given right here at that previous resistance, as I said before, on 1,844.60. Now for the stop loss, the stop loss should be actually mentioned right here, just a little bit below that support level right here. If the market actually has went below that uh, support level, it means that this uh, previous resistance trend line uh, has, has failed to become a new support trend line and therefore the market might continue the fall. Therefore, uh, that's going to be our stop loss. So the stop loss is just about 63 pips. And I think guys, this is really very good when we are talking about trading gold because gold is moving very fast and um, we can expect about 200 or 300 pips profit from that from trading gold so uh, the stop loss should be about 1800 i would say like that 1827 no more i think it's a little bit lower just a little bit only somewhere here yes that's going to be our stop loss and that's going to be where we will start buying of course i have to mention something always be aware to the unexpected news or announcements so for example don't set pending order i'm telling you do not set pending order please don't use pending orders why because the gold is moving very fast and there is a chance that there will be any news that might actually affect the market or change the currency or ch sorry change the currency i mean change the currency direction there might be actually a strong bearish candle appear right here so the market will immediately hit your pin, uh, pending order and it's going to also hit your stop loss in no in, in less than one, one minute so please be careful and don't place any pending orders. Pay attention, be aware, be awake about this deal and keep your eyes on it and just look at the market, how it reacts to the level I have mentioned. Place if you want one trade with a small lot. And if you notice that the market is reacting to the level and reversing already, you can open if you wish another deal with bigger lot size. But in the end, of course, make sure that you are maintaining a proper money management and you are having uh, controlling over your, your, your funds and make sure that you're always prepared for the losses because the losses are always, um, I don't want to say always occur, of course, but they are always 
possibly to happen always there is nothing guaranteed in forex just because just because this signal coming from extreme trader doesn't mean that it's going to be 100 percent profitable so uh, there goes your signal or sorry the deal of the day and i really hope it's going to be profitable for everyone and i hope everyone will make good profits of it so in the end i hope that was informative to you and i would like to thank you for watching